there's been some great work on what predicts, what behavioral markers predict divorce in couples counseling. Really yeah. solid work. Okay, so here's one predictor. If when the couple is talking in front of a therapist and one of them or the other or both roll their eyes, there's like a 95% chance they're going to be divorced within six months. And that's contempt. Eh? They've got so they've become so disconnected because they don't communicate because the resentment has built up that they now uh -huh. have contempt for each other. But here's here's another cool fact from that research. So if you have people track the number of positive and negative interactions with their partner, you can calculate ratios and then you can see what the ratio is that that lends itself to the successful maintenance of a relationship. Uh -huh. And so you might think, well, the more positive interactions, the better. And that's kind of true. So if it falls below five positive to one negative, the relationship is in danger. But if really? it rises, a, you have five to one. And you can kind of see that because, you know, negative events are more memorable and, and, and more powerful than positive ones. And so right. you know that if you read YouTube comments, you know. Yeah. And, but if it rises above 11 to one, the relationship is also in danger. And you could imagine that what you want in a relationship is, well, you want support and love and you want most of your interactions to be positive. But you want your partner to slap you down then when you're being stupid. Right. Because and then if they don't, out comes your inner tyrant, right? You're just going to dominate right. them if they don't push back. And so if right. you have any sense too, if you have a partner, you want to encourage them to put limits on you, you know, especially yeah. if they're a little more timid than you temperamentally. It's like you don't want yeah. to run roughshod over them because they know some things you don't. Right. But it's so right. cool that it's above 11 to 1. So that means too, too much positivity is also is the death knoll for a relationship.